All right, I'm going to do a quick review of this welder. This is the RBM 1550. Boom. What you're going to want to do is prep your torch. You don't want your consumables here. You don't want your nozzles on just yet until we get the wire all the way through the torch here. We're going to take our gun and feed it or onto the wire. Very carefully. All right. I turn the amperage up all the way. We got it set to flux. And what that will do is give us the feed speed that we need. That's how fast that goes. If your amperage is set too low while you're trying to feed the wire, you're gonna be here all day. So we're gonna feed it at the max. Any moment. There it is. Now we can put the consumables on. And that's it. Let's see how well we do. Not my best work. Super easy. Actually worked really, really well. One of the things I wanted to test with this welder is how well it'll work with the uh, C25 gas. So I have that hooked up to the machine. I'm still running Super flux four amps, wire in it. Stick. Uh, we've got the amperage at 37 amps. Uh, and the voltage is balanced based on whatever the machine says it should be. Uh, I'm gonna do a quick bead as if I'm joining these pieces together. Grind it down and see what the porosity looks like and if, uh, if it's sticking. Uh, so here we're going to give it a shot. Looks good. Now do the same thing on like the cardinal, cardinal direction. If you can. Uh, yeah, that works. Okay. Alright, I think we're good. Uh, yeah. How about we uh, clean it off again with the, the little wire brush and then spray paint it? Call it a day. Alright, we're going to test stick welding. So I got my uh, ground clamp and my stinger hooked up for stick. And we're going to try some E6013 right here on some half inch bar. Alright, so they gave us a little tool. It's not bad for a little small. So it's not horrible, it looks pretty good, except for of course this end here, I screwed that up. So I really, really like this machine. Uh, this little tagline is kind of funny because uh, 
foolish, uh, playful, or silly might be a better word, but uh, anyway, I feel kind of foolish. I was having a hard time getting the lift uh, TIG so, to work. Torch. This is a reboot torch. Into the grip, into the negative terminal. The jumper is disconnected. We're not using the spool gun. And this is the ground clamp in positive. Now we just got to find something to weld. Gas is coming on. And weld. Oh, yeah. E-C-E-N. Cool.